So these are like how you change it to metric system. And for example, one mile equals 1.6 kilometers. So in EHS, <laughs> we run a mile every other day, and it's just driving me crazy. <laughs> <laughs> so when I told my mom, that mom in Korea, that I run a mile every other day, she was like, oh, well, okay, it's not a big deal. But she didn't know the metric system of one mile. She thought it was not a big deal because it was one. So I like I searched this for a kilometer, and I told her that it was 1.6 kilometers, and she was like, "Oh my gosh, you run 1.6 kilometers every other day? You were the kid who didn't even walk 10 minute distance, <laughs> and I run a mile every other day." And so it was kind of like different, so my mom couldn't understand it at first. And this is what this is one of the famous skaters, bigger skaters in South Korea. And she's Yuna Kim and she's 21 years old. So in Vancouver, Vancouver Olympics and Lady Single Park, she got gold medal and she got world record there. And she was um, she was designated as the world's most influential people 100 in Times newspaper, and these are some pictures of her. I'm not anybody who could do that in jeans. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 And this is South Korean uh, famous soccer player called Ji Sung Park. And he, he got MVP in America's professional soccer league all-star game. And he got gold bar, gold ball award in Peace Cup International Soccer Game, and he's now in Manchester United FC since July 2005. And he is famous swimmer in South Korea, and he is Taewon Park, and he's 22 years old. So he got. A uh, 400 meter gold medal in FINA World Championships, and he won 100, 200, 400 meter in Santa Clara International Grand Prize, and he got, he won 400 meter gold medal in Pan Pacific Swimming Championships. So I personally um, put him as my role model. So he is Kim Eun Pan, and he went to Harvard University Graduate School, and he is now the U.S. Secretary General. So he became the Secretary General in 2007, and 2011 he got re-elected, so he's still in the Secretary General in the U.N. So who knew? that Samsung or LG was a Korean company. I knew Samsung was. Oh. I didn't know LG was. No yeah. Was. So I have so many cell phones or like electric machines that are like Samsung or LG. And every time I see the mark, it makes my day. <laughs> <laughs> Although I'm not the owner, it's like my country thing. <laughs> Good, I'll make your day. I have an LG phone and an LG refrigerator. <laughs> And this is my camera. Yeah. <laughs> and this is LG. And this is this is actually a commercial in Korea about LG. And this is the LG mark. What does LG stand for? Is, does it stand for certain words? I don't think so. Okay. Looks like a person who's on the symbol. Yeah. That's why. And who knew Hyundai was Korean company? Oh. Yeah. Oh. So Hyundai is famous for its cars and ships, so you can see this mark and you can know it's Hyundai. So personally, I am so proud of Hyundai because the, the founder of Hyundai was born in the same city that I was born. So I, this is personally like my favorite company and Samsung, LG and Samsung, uh, Samsung, LG and Hyundai are like the biggest companies in South Korea too. Some good companies. 
So South Korea has Pyeongchang Olympics in 2018, and we was we were elected in 2011 recently. So it was a huge big news for South Korea. So it would be awesome if you guys can pay attention to Pyeongchang Olympics 2018. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And Korean Wave. So this is like um, the most famous animation for kids in South Korea. And this animation is called Bororo. And we recently got good news that Bororo is going to international like character. So we were hoping that Bororo can represent our country someday. Is he a penguin? Is that what yes. It is? Yes, it is penguin. <laughs> <laughs> and this is a girl group called Girls Generation. And that is the picture of Girls Generation in the uh, front page of Japanese magazine. And this is one of Korea's girls group called 21. And this is the picture of um, foreign people welcoming Korean like singers. And this is a picture of Wonder Girls being oh, an American sorry. show. So who knew Wonder Girls before? No. <laughs> so Wonder Girls is an American TV show right here. And now, uh, as I said, there is a girl group called Girls' Generation, and now I'm going to show you the music video of Girls' Generation. I like her shirt. Oh, Korean fashions are cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the designers are awesome. Cutting edge. Oh, no. After this presentation, I'm going to show you the video, so I'm sorry about this mistake. And this is the end of my presentation, and these are the guests that have, like, actually um, have, should have been in this presentation. So I am thankful to Riley, Corey, Rachel, Amanda, Jacob, Ryan, Ashley, and Miss Starter, and Miss Pigeon. Thank you so much for being here. And of course, ATC, my exchange student program. Thank you so much.